everyone, so it's Molly here. What's up? How's it going? Today I will be showing you how to get a sweatproof, heatproof makeup look, as you can see on my face here. All of the products used are from Red Earth Beauty. If you don't know what Red Earth is, Red Earth is a makeup, so cosmetics, as well as a skincare brand. All of their products are relatively natural and use good ingredients for your skin. The brand is cruelty free and also based in Australia. All of the products used can be purchased at redearth.com. Now you can also find them at Sephora in Pitt Street Mall in Sydney. I hope you enjoy the tutorial and I'll catch you later. The first product I'll be taking is the Prime Perfection Mattifying Makeup Base, which is an oil-free, fragrance-free, lightweight mattifying primer. And I'm just applying this with my fingers. Next up, I'm taking the FaceTime Longwear Fluid Foundation. Now, something that I love about this product, not only does it have a pump, I mean, pumps are pretty cool, but the product itself contains light reflecting particles, which are going to give you that really dewy, natural look. And as well as making your skin look good, it's also going to look after your skin as it has an SPF of 18. To apply the product, I'm just blending it out with a damp sponge. Using my kabuki brush, I'm now going to apply the Perfect Touch Press Setting Powder and can we just take a moment to appreciate this packaging? It is beautiful. Okay, so basically I'm just taking the kabuki brush and just pressing the powder into the foundation to make sure everything's set. To prime my eyelids, I'm taking the Eye Wonder Mineral Infused Eye Primer and if you're someone like me who tends to get quite dry eyelids, this primer contains really nourishing ingredients like aloe vera and vitamin E. Using my Dior eyeshadow brush, I'm going to take one of my Shade Play Silk Finish eyeshadow colours and this is in Beach Bronze, which is a really beautiful orangey bronze colour, which if you have blue eyes, I think you need this colour because it is actually amazing. And I'm just putting this on the inner third of my eyelids. Now taking my other shade play silk finish eye colour in Wanderer, I'm just applying this to the out of two thirds of my eyelid. And just so you know, both of these eyeshadows are amazingly pigmented and they blend like a dream. <laughs> to add a little more definition, I'm taking Wanderer again and just applying that into the crease and then blending it out with a clean brush. Using the other side of the Duo eyeshadow brush, I'm taking Beach Bronze and applying that in my inner corners and then taking Wanderer again and applying it along the lower lash line. As for lashes, I'm taking the Wide Eyes Full Lash Mascara and unlike a mascara with like a really thick bristly brush, you're going to have a lot more control over how you want to define and separate your lashes as this has a thinner plastic brush. For a little something extra, I'm taking the Perfect Line Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner and just applying little dots along my lower lash line. Now this is going to be a lot less smudge worthy than if you were to do like a massive cat wing or something like that. Here is the completed look. I hope you guys enjoyed this and don't forget to check out Red Earth at their website or at Sephora in Sydney.